of Yu Yon Siong and Lee Yong Dae. Finished second at the recent World Championships in the men's doubles. So they would appear to have the advantage over Zhu and Zhang of China. Zhu Chen and Zhang Nan representing China in the first of the doubles matches. So it's quite feasible that it would be one all after those two matches are played. Then in the third match we have Lin Dan of China against Li Dongqun of Korea. Lin Dan, twice Olympic champion and five times world champion. You would think that he goes in as a very warm favorite to beat Li. If that was the case, it would be 2-1 to China. Then we come to the next doubles match where Kim Sarang and Kim Gi Jung will represent Korea playing Kai Yun and Fu Haifeng of China. Now again, it would appear that the Koreans have the advantage in that doubles contest because uh, you look at the current ranking of uh, the Korean pair, it's number five in the world. It's certainly superior to their opponents. So we could get to the end of the fourth match and it'll be two all. And that would mean the final singles match between Guo Huan of China and Li Hyunil of Korea would decide the gold medal. It may not pan out that way. They may not get to play tonight. Maybe we won't need the second uh, doubles match either. But these are the possibilities that it could be the fifth match that decides it if we find that players and, t and teams rankings prove to uh, prove true when the results are decided it's all ahead of us it's going to be a fascinating evening in this gold medal match and uh, everyone in the crowd very much looking forward to first of all Chen Long of China in the singles in the yellow against Son Wan Ho of Korea in the blue Chen to serve. And a very calm beginning to the match. Both playing short. And you could almost say gently. Smash of the uh, contest so far. And Chen into the net with the drive. Being the home of uh, the South Korean player. You can imagine the crowd are going to be giving him plenty of support. Son Wan Ho, hearing the crowd there roar as he leads to love. Quite a few supporters for China here as well. Just looking at the crowd across from me, behind the song. It's, it seems that the top tier is full of Korean supporters. The bottom tier has uh, more supporters of the player from China. demonstrated there by Song. Pace and accuracy in that shot. It's a good start from Song.
Chen lunging forward and uh, flicking it long. So, a very good start for Son Wan Ho of Korea. Leading 4-1. And the chant goes up from the crowd here in the Taeyang Gymnasium in Incheon. trying to play it to the line into the net and Chen in the yellow with a world ranking of number two even though he did win the world championship in Copenhagen this year Chen beat Malaysian world number one Li Chong Wei in the semi-final as China defeated Chinese Taipei should say uh, China defeating Malaysia I should say South Korea defeating Chinese Taipei in the semi-finals both winning three love from the back of the court. That drive to the sideline. Makes another error. This is a very tight battle right now. A battle of judgment and poise rather than power. And Son Wan Ho is winning this battle. Attacking at the net, flicking it past his opponent. Leads by six. Here we have China versus Korea in the Asian Games gold medal team final of 2014. It was the same four years ago in Guangzhou when China took the gold medal and South Korea finished with the silver. Indonesia and Thailand taking the bronze medals on that occasion. And the speed and the power there of Son catching Chin by surprise. On the backhand side, he didn't have time to react to play the shot back with any force and again finds the net. And this is a tremendous start by the underdog, Son Wan Ho. He's been in very good form recently. But nevertheless, uh, a dream start for him. out good judgment by Chen and he needed that judgment some relief for him Son taking a seven point lead until finally that mistake
China have won the last three men's team events at the Asian Games. Also won in 2006. Short-lived serve for Chen. Son takes over the serve again. Chen will be glad to walk from the court and confer with his coach to uh, quickly try and turn things around here. This is an important discussion. See the look on his face. What can I do to turn the tide here? This is not what I expected. Korea last won the gold medal in the men's team event in 2002. So they've missed out the last two Asian games. They have a chance here in 2014. Son Wan Ho played in Guangzhou in 2010 when they finished second in the team's event. Drops over the net. Well, that is a great way to start again after the break. A little lucky possibly, but a great way to start for Son. Low serve. Just all the way of career at the moment. Son Wan Ho. Probably as surprised as anyone. Chen, just all at sea, he's put a number into the net and a number too long. Can't get the length and the height right. Good recovery by Son. Another power smash from Chen and the sour strong. It's a good response, good defence from Son. And then it forced Chen to miss hit too long. So 3-14. An almighty comeback from here, from Chen, to save the first game. Down by 11. He needs to play himself into the match, let alone this game. That's a great shot. Just what he needed to give himself some confidence. Beautiful placement. And tremendous angle out of reach of Son. Son would not have expected that. Chen with serve. He looks back at the sideline as if to say, could I have let that go? No, surely he had to play. No worry about that. From Chen, too good that time. Too much force in his shot. Son couldn't control his, and it floated out. Wasn't as deep as Son would have hoped. Didn't miss by too far, but Chen comfortably able to allow that to drop out. 5:15.
maintaining this big lead of 11 points on one hole. Son with a world ranking of seven in the world compared to his opponent's two. Chen was there, but he couldn't pick it up. He hopped forward. Son right on top here. Says he wants to be remembered for a long time as a badminton player and to become a PE teacher when he retires. Well, the way to be remembered is to beat Chen here and to uh, win a gold medal for his team. There is nothing Son cannot do. He is inspired here. Absolutely inspired. His shot making is outstanding. He knows exactly where to hit and how to hit it. He's done it again. Chen completely nonplussed by his inability to get into rallies here. Son is able to finish it so quickly. his way chin well he won't be going to the casino after the uh, game if this continues his luck's out and it's game point to son one ho of korea he could almost serve with his eyes closed the way he's playing it's out from chin return of serve well out chen takes the towel and he's just trying rub the thought of that game away and start again 21 5 in quick time the first game is over well, what a remarkable performance by Sun one ho it just uh, shows that you completely uh, throw out throw out the calculations when you're playing for your country as I was saying before the match, if uh, the matches go according to rankings, it would uh, go all the way to the fifth match tonight. The Chinese singles players would win their two matches, Lin Dan and Chen Long, and uh, the two Korean doubles teams would win their matches. And then uh, we would be uh, playing off at the fifth match to see who will win the gold. But already, all of the predictions, all of the likelihoods have been thrown out the window. The first game going to Son Wan Ho, talking to his coach. And it went to him 21 to 5. What an emphatic victory. Chen is considerably taller than Son, 188 centimetres to 177. In fact, uh, Chen's parents were both basketball players. But, uh, at the age of eight, he turned to badminton. He's 25 years old now, Chen Long. But he's in a world of trouble, a world of hurt right now. And he needs to start the second game very well after Son took the first 21-5. Son does begin brilliantly. 
What's the shuttle got into the corner with such speed and accuracy? He is right on top of his game. Son makes an error. A rare mistake into the net. Might be clutching at straws, but you would think that Chen would see that as a sign that things are going to turn his way. And Son makes another mistake. You could see that the high clear lifted high and deep by Chen. And while in the air, Son had a quick look at the end line check his position and then played the shot so many sports where you can't afford to take your eye off the ball shuttlecock one where the top class players will check their position and then refocus on the shuttlecock as it drops Son with sheer power straight through Shen Came at him like a bullet, and he didn't have time to get his gun out of the holster. <laughs> He's out thinking his opponent here, Son Wan Ho. Chen should have been able to reach that, but... He was in two minds and he just reacted too late to the shot down the line. Chen has the longer reach, the longer arms. He seemed to be in the right court as well. Three errors by Son into the net. Are allowing Chen to make some headway into this game. But it's all about pressure, it's all about making sure you keep your opponent on his toes, don't let him get comfortable, and that's what Chen has to do here, to fight his way back. He knows that he's capable of winning this. Good save from Chen. Chen working on the forehand of Son. Oh, Son brilliantly with that drop shot. Outstanding, outstanding play by both. That jumping power smash from Chen to the right after he forced Son back into the corner. Son recovered well, but there's no stopping that power and that placement. That is exactly what Chen Long needs to give himself the confidence to get back to playing his game at its best. He'll take a lot out of that last rally. again the sheer accuracy of Son has got to be seen to be believed he hit with such pace and just that fraction inside the line this rally was evenly poised until Son suddenly just took the bit between his teeth and went for the shot finished it there and then it's four all
Chen opened up with that power smash, but he wasn't able to get it past Son. Son played his way back into the rally, and then he was the one who finished it. Gets this shot here. It was a defensive slap back from Chen, and a power smash from Son straight at the feet. He had no shot. Son edges ahead 5-4. Chen leaping to the opportunity there with great gusto as that was just coming over the net and Chen made sure he got to it to hit it with the forehand overhead didn't allow it to drop below the net they stick to each other again five all Forehand again, Chen directing a lot of his attack to the forehand of Son. And finally did uh, draw the error from him as he tried to play short at the net. And that play of Son letting him down that time. So Chen ahead by one. Chen got there, he's disappointed, he thought he actually got there to that, just as it looked like Son might be able to finish him off as he leapt in the air, Chen there but not able to play the shot well enough, once again scores locked at 6 all. well this is more the tension of a contest that we expected in this first singles match of the gold medal contest, men's team gold medal at stake, up for grabs, And the judgment from Son proves sound. Son sneaks ahead by one. No one has led by more than one in this second game, unlike the first where Son led by seven at 9-2. And stretched that out, he led by, uh, well, he really stretched it out to 18-5 and then finished it off 21-5. A run of points went his way. He's having to work much harder now. Chen finding his way back into this match, this singles match. And that's a great shot. It's in, and it's seven all. I'm just wiping a bit of sweat off his hands and his forehead as well. A bit of sweat on the court. But Chen certainly will have taken confidence from uh, beating Li Chong Wei, the Malaysian world number one in that semi-final. That will have made him believe that uh, he can go on with this to uh, contribute to winning the gold medal. Straight through him, and it's in. Such a fascinating game, badminton, when you see the cat and mouse at the net, and then all of a sudden the attack like a lion. But, uh, and it was Son who attacked there to lead 8-7. Just out from Chen, and all of a sudden, 
there is a two-point break in the uh, pattern. Chen nearly leapt over the net there. Lurching forward with great gusto. Again, making sure that he didn't have to get involved in net play. He wanted to attack it early. Going across court with a smash into the net. So Shotty enjoys playing, leaping high and smashing it. But on that occasion, pulled it down to the net. Trying to give his opponent a little opportunity to get to the uh, shuttlecock. Some to serve with that backhand, either low or flicking deep. The return is out. So for the first time in this second game, Son leads by three. Chen has never led by more than one. Son now leading by three. Suddenly. Uh, Gotten a go on from seven all. At the World Championships in Copenhagen not too long ago, Son Wan Ho in the singles made it through to the quarterfinals. That was about as good as it got for him. And Son plays behind him. Looked as if he was going to play to the corner, and that was their direction Chen was playing, running. But instead, Son back behind him as Chen was turning to go the other way. It's a very smart reading of the play, anticipation of what was going to happen next. Four-point lead. And Son into the net. And lift it over, trying to play short, move Chen around. Chen being tall has the disadvantage of mobility compared to the smaller man. Has the advantage, particularly when he plays that smash, that he can bring it down from high to low over the net. Frustration for Chen. Down by four, and he needs to quickly close the gap. Tremendous hand speed and reactions there from both men. Son winning out, and another test of wills and concentration. So quickly, Shuttlecock is rocketing back and forth. Now 
This is a dramatic lead for Son. Son Won Ho having taken the first game 21 to 5 over the world number two and current world champion Chen Long now leads him 14-9 in the second game. Great variation, but into the net. He looks back at the end line. And looks across at his coach and nods to him. 10-14. Chen has the serve and he's got to start turning serves into points. Can't afford to uh, lose these rallies. And he's dictating terms. And he's done it this time. So he claws one point back. Starting to edge towards the cliff, Chen, but he had a peek over and now he takes a step back. Reduces the margin to three and he'll change the shuttlecock. Doesn't want to let himself down, most definitely doesn't want to let his team and country down, Chen Long. 25 year old. Son a year older at 26. And it fell out. It flicked the net and Chen in despair. Knew he couldn't play a shot, but the shuttlecock ricocheted off the top of the net and out, and the margin reduced to two. Chen was a member of the 2010 Chinese team in Guangzhou at the Asian Games, which won the gold medal. So both men played in that last team event in Guangzhou four years ago and it was Chen who was a member of the gold winning team and Son had to settle for a silver as a member of the Korean team Pure power from Chen. Earlier, there's a bit of a slice on his shot halfway through the rally. Not that time, that was pure power. And Son simply couldn't react quick enough. 13 14. So Chen Long from China fighting back. And getting back into more comfortable territory. Which will allow him to play his own game without tension and the the weight of the nation on his shoulders. Just incredible athleticism there. Like a gymnast, the amount of spring he had into that back corner to be able to play such a powerful shot from initially almost a defensive position, turning it into an attacking shot. Very fit and full of ideas. Able to create the shot in his mind and then execute it on with a two-point lead. Great return from Chen down the line. Hit it beautifully. No room for error. Fourteen, fifteen. Chen Long will serve. Can he draw level? 
Hasn't been level since seven all. Oh, Son tried to go behind him and might have just snatched at it a fraction. Chen was running across the court to cover the far corner, the backhand corner. Son decided to try and go the other way and he put it into the net. He didn't even have to hit it hard. Chen was always going the other way, but Son made the mistake. He might have just snatched for, for the uh, victorious point, and it is 15 all. Ooh, it dropped just out. girls from the uh, Chinese team who won the gold medal last night are here and you can see most definitely on the edge of their seat Son leaping in the air like a grasshopper Put himself in great position. Does it again. Repeated leaps with that spring he has in his legs to allow him to hit steeply. Edging towards the end of this second game. If Son's in front, the game is over. The match is over. Oh, great hand speed this time from Chen winning out and he pumps the air he'll dig deep here Chen Long with the serve dig deep and show his championship qualities you can bet on it but Asson is playing so brilliantly he's hard to deny And gets one through Son. Footwork of both men is outstanding. It's brilliant to watch. They get themselves into such good position with such fine balance. Look at that from Son. And then the power coming straight back at the body of Son. And he was unable to play it off his chest. Aimed him so quickly, he couldn't get into any kind of position. And it is 17 all. It's been a long way back from uh, for Chen but he got back to 15 all and he's hanging on at 17 all uh, Chen knew he was a goner there he all but walked away from it Son hovering over the net On one hole of the Republic of Korea sneaks ahead again at 17-18, and here will serve now 18-17. Oh, Chen didn't quite put it away the first time. Lucky was able to uh, come forward and. Make, it, make sure of it the second time. He would have kicked himself if he didn't uh, play that for the winner. 18 all. Three points away from one of these players taking the first game. I should say the second game after the first game went to Son 21-5. like as if both were trying to swat as many flies as possible in two seconds and Chen eventually was the quicker 
19-18, and it's Chen who pokes his head in front just at the right time, just when he needs to be in front. Son taking the first game. Chen needs to win the second game. He levels it up again with a masterful shot. Masterful power smash. 19 all. No one looking in any direction but court one here at Kai Young Gymnasium. 19 all. Time to serve. And that backhand plays low. And it's into the net. Into the net from Chong, uh, from Chen. And it brings up game point and match point. It brings up match point. Chen cannot afford one error. Son can take it here and now, take this first singles match. 20 to 19. Son to serve. Chen waits. And Chen leaps at the opportunity there. And it's 20 all. Great aggression and attack there. He had no choice. It was the only shot to play, and he did it well. It's 20 all. So the first to an advantage of two here, up until we get to uh, 29. If we get to 29. Great defence from Chen, and another great lift. Son finally puts it away. Son has another match point. But Chen saved one match point. But now he faces another. Son to serve at 21-20. Match point for the second time. It's out. Son couldn't control it and the chance slips through his fingers. Now the big chant goes up from the Chinese supporters for Chen. It's 21 all. He saved two match points. Son might have been a little tense there. It didn't look like climbing over the net. So suddenly Chen has a game point. At 22-21. And Son will be trying to put the regret out of his mind of failing to take those two match points. He has to quickly fight back here to level once more. Chen. 22-21, game point. Oh, into the net. And he grimaces. How did he miss? Just dropping a little low on him in that right corner. Got down around shoulder height, 
And he hit it flat, but into the net. 22 all. This is gripping stuff. In just the first match of this gold medal contest. Some playing short, trying to win at the net, but he didn't do it. And he forfeits another point. And it becomes 23-22 in favour of Chen. So he has his second game point. It's out. It's out. And Chin takes the second game. He fights back. The world champion fights back and levels at one game each. 24-22. He's taken the second game. Uh, that shows true championship qualities. Shows how much it means to him as well. And Son will be feeling deflated. He had two match points and wasn't able to convert them now it's one game all and we look back over that second game and at one stage son had a four-point lead in fact a five-point lead at 14-9 but then chen began to claw his way back into the match leveled at 15 all 17 all 18 all 19 all and uh, point for point through as I said, two match points, and it was the second game point before Chen could finally win 24-22 in the second game. After the first game was taken so convincingly by Son, 21-5. Third and deciding game begins in this singles match. Son draws first blood. Just dropping out and the line judge signalling. Great to see the women from last night's gold medal match here supporting the men today. China versus Korea again as it was last night in the women's gold medal match won by China. But it was a tremendously hard fought. As Chen plays it out. In all three matches played in the women's gold medal match, Korea took the first game and China won the second and third games to, in the end, win the gold medal three love. But very hard fought and always coming from behind. And Chen will have to do that again tonight as we begin the men's matches for the gold medal. 
But we can see uh, the likes of uh, Sung Yi Hun of Korea here and the Wang Zhizhan of China in the audience. And some of the other players, if not all of them, are here supporting uh, their country's men in the team's event. A very good start to the third game for Son. Chen falling back into the errors he made in the first game where he just couldn't get the length right. Four in a row from Chen. And he makes it hard for himself. He's going to have to uh, fight back again. Could be a slight lapse in concentration after putting so much effort into the second game. Staving off match points and then winning it 24-22. It required a lot of mental energy. Topples over and a lift from Son. He can't get it back the second time. When you're up against the best in the world, you need a little bit of, a little bit of luck to go your way. And those neck cords were just topples over off the tape. You'd hope they would even out over a match, but they don't always. Chen Long to serve for China. Down 1-4. With the backhand, low serve. Long from Chen. Or was it in? No, it was in. It was in. It dropped in. Have been very close at the far end. Chen needed that as much as anything so that he starts to believe in the length that he's playing. <laughs> Son does a Chen as Chen. Floats it back over the net and Son leaping forward to crunch it with the forehand. Chen from the back. Son coming forward. Took the risk that it might be hit over his head, but he, was, he judged it exactly right. That's where his height is one of his advantages. He can hit from such a high point and hit so steeply. Two in a row, coming forward. Trying to go down the line. Son misses. Into the net. It's interesting talking about the mental energy that Chen expended to win the second game and might have just relaxed a touch and suddenly found himself down love four. 
But on the other hand, you think about Son having lost what was a match there for the taking, having uh, not been able to take that second game. You'd think that he would be very deflated, but instead he came out firing. And now he has to maintain the rage, if you like. And all of a sudden it's Chen who fights back to 5 all. And Chen also knows that he can come from behind. He's just done it in the second game. So he will feel anything's possible, even when he's in trouble. Son may have doubts coming out of this game as a single player ranked seventh in the world up against the world champion and man ranked second. He would have wondered, can I beat him? And then he wasn't able to put him away when he had match point. Oh, it looked as if Son had played the winner. When he played it to the line, it looked as if that was the winning shot, but a tremendous diving save from Chen made Son have to play again, and he couldn't get it back. Always worth making the effort to force your opponent to one more shot in a rally you just never know when uh, he might make a mistake not that that was an easy shot from son but nevertheless he missed it and chen leads 6-5 Waves to his opponent, but I don't think too much damage was done as Son hit it low at him, hard and fast straight at the legs. Chen couldn't play. So Chen's lead, the first time he had led in this third game, is quickly whipped away and it's back to six all. Son just uh, a little surprised at his own shot. Chen very relieved to take an easier point. Once again, Chen leads by one. foot but now he's attacking he puts it into the net you can see Son at one stage change his shot looked like he was going to play short at the net instead flicking it deep great deception as to what shot he was going to play and that's part of the art of badminton deception to bring your forward, opponent forward and then suddenly play over him or the reverse of that it's seven all Son has the luck this time. I suppose when you're playing at the net, if it topples over, you claim, well, I played it well enough as it bobbles off the tape and made it very hard for Chen to play. Or, well, impossible, in fact. Earlier in the rally, though, the, the foot speed, the quickness around the court of Son was on display. Short, quick steps.
saving with the lift. Son stays in the rally. Oh, and he can't climb it over. It falls back. All the shots were on display from both players. Both shuttlers there displaying a full range of shots. The finesse, the power, the aggression. One side to the other. Son ahead by two. side to the other slight misjudgment and it's 7-10 Son extends his lead to three but he'll know that his opponent Chen is never beaten now that helps Son's case the Korean leads 11-7 as twice in a row Chen Playing that to forehand, cross court from the backhand side and missing at the far line. It's not the first time in the match that Son has been ahead by three or four. It doesn't always mean that he wins the game. It did in the first game. He won a 21 to five. But in the second, from uh, a lead of 14-10 for Son, Chen was able to fight back and eventually took the second game, 24-22. Chen Long, who took the bronze medal in the London Olympic Games in the singles. 11, 7, play. Son serving at 11-7. The Korean ahead by four. Plays down the forehand side, then plays to the backhand side. And it was fruitful when he went to that backhand side of Chen, inside the line, zeroing it in low, inside the line. 12-7, a five-point advantage. again this time he does go to the forehand side he waited and waited until he had the shot he wanted and his opponent stranded in the middle not sure where it was going to go 7-13 it's a big lead it's on been there before And the Koreans also know that after last night, the Chinese kept fighting back. Brilliant play by both. Incredible angles. And finally, Son wins out. Chen into the net.
perfect net play by both players in the middle of that rally. Incredible angles, judiciously played. Such narrow range for error, playing over the net with deft touch. 7-14. Fourteen seven for Sona with serve. And Chen comes back. Chen comes back. With a power smash into the corner. And Chen will serve at 8-14. You can't help looking at that scoreboard from his point of view. It looks more like 8-14 than 14-8. And of course, that's exactly what it is. He's got the serve. Smart play that time, very clever from Chen. He played the drive. Gave Son no time to react. Hit it back hard and flat and behind him as Son was moving towards the centre line. Son going the wrong way and I don't know that he had time to play the shot anyway. Chen can't believe it. He was on the back foot and Son attacked early. I think Chen expected the power to come at him so quickly. He backs off here, he stranded in the middle. It was just the perfection of the shot as much as anything. Six point lead again for Son. Make it seven. He keeps the pressure right on Chen. And Son led by seven at 14-7. Chen fought back, took two points off him. Now Son responds and leads by seven at 16-9. for each other at the net the net play was a draw and it came to the power down the line son the victor Chen didn't quite have the reach thought he might be able to stretch just in case your arithmetic is failing you now it's an eight point lead Played it. He had to play it. Dynamic play from Son Wan Ho. Son Wan Ho of Korea is in a powerful position now. 18 9 he leads. He's three points away from winning this singles match. He's got breathing space here, but he's got to keep the pressure on. And one point disappears from that comfort level that he was experiencing.
brilliant from Chen. Absolutely brilliant. He really tested Son there. Excellent touch. Moving him around the court, playing short, playing long, and then seizing on the smash. And everyone in the Kai Young Gymnasium is thinking the same thing, particularly the Korean supporters, though. Surely Chen can't fight back again. He was down by nine at 18-9. He claws back two points. He narrows the gap to seven. Surely not again. But just maybe. Son, so close. Three points from taking the match. Chen to serve at 11-18. It's one game each. This is the decider of the singles. Oh, Son takes another giant step towards victory. Every point is all but gold at the moment. We can't say it's gold because there's more matches to come. But every step he takes towards winning a rally, it's 19-11. Wonderful return there from Chen, lifting it high into the corner on the backhand for Son here. And then from this position, he's able to play a winner. Incredible. That power smash and great judgment of where the line is when he's looking up in the air. 12-19. On, playing short at the net. Out wide, just that fraction higher. Nervously, the crowd look at the scoreboard, 13-19. They should be breathing easily, but they're not. A chant goes up from both camps. Chinese and the Koreans. Great touch from Chen. Oh, it's on the line. It's on the line. It's in. Chen diving forward. But again, that brilliant soft touch of Son. Millimeters in it. Got the line. It's 2013. Son has match point. He had two match points in the second game. He couldn't win it. He's going to change the shuttlecock. Gets a new one. His first match point in the third game. 2013. Chen lets it go and he's called it right. It must have been difficult to let it drop. It would be a horrible way to lose. But he knew what he was doing. Still match point though at 14-20.
Oh, topples over, and Son wins. Son beats Chen. Korea beats China in the first singles match of this gold medal contest. Well, Son should go to the casino tonight because that was a lucky drop over the net for him. But we've seen it go both ways during the contest. Unlucky for Chen that it was at match point. But Son, what a wonderful display. He's upset Chen Long. Son Wan Ho is the Republic of Korea's hero here in the singles. He's upset Chen, the world champion. He's upset a player ranked five above him in the top ten on the world scale. It toppled over the net. Oh, it's a horrible way to lose, but a wonderful way to win. Any, any way to win is a win to savour. And Son collapses. What a dramatic, dramatic match.